Here's how to turn off two-factor authentication on your iPhone. Now, if you have an iPhone and you prefer it doesn't text you a code every single time you try to log into your Apple account or Apple ID, I'll walk you through the entire process. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, what you're going to do is first is heading to your settings. And then at the very top, you're going to tap on your name and Apple account here. Now that we're in here, you can see right under personal information is sign in and security. Tap on that. You'll be able to see here email addresses and phone numbers that you can use to sign in. And then under security is two factor authentication. And you can tap on that. Now, there are some requirements on here. Essentially, when you initially sign up for your Apple account and you turn on two-step verification or two-factor authentication, you have two weeks to completely disable it. Otherwise, it is permanently on there. So you need essentially a device or a phone number to verify that account. However, you can always just change those to whatever you want. So for instance, on here, uh, you can see Trevor's MacBook Pro. I can tap on that. And if I no longer have this computer and I don't want to use that device to verify, all I have to do is hit remove account at the very bottom. And that will remove this device from my Apple account. And from there, I don't need to worry about that device needing approval, essentially, or using that device to get into my account. Now I can also go back here and go to the phone number and you can see this is the phone number that is attached to the two-factor authentication. I can just hit remove from my account. And then of course I can hit add a trusted phone number. And this allows me to just enter in a new phone number that I can use to unlock or log in to my account on any other device. Again, unfortunately, Apple has chosen that this is a requirement after two weeks, you cannot completely turn this off, but you can change it to any device or any phone number that you want to. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.